Welcome to episode 3 of Penfold Plays Europa Universalis 4 with the Warring States mod. We are France, and if you missed last the last episode, we had just won a war against the now uh, conquered Frisia. We got this little province here. Well, these guys got Calais and the Flanders, uh, the original provinces. So now France is a four province state. Now the Warring States mod, just to remind everybody, is a mod which you can download on Steam. Uh, basically it just carves up every kingdom in Europe and Asia into smaller duchies and, pro and normal provinces. Uh, best example, there's the Ottomans have very small territory to start off with. Um, we're going to start this off, we got uh, 20 minutes for this episode, and uh, my goal today is to try and, we have a peace time with Orleans, uh, we'll have a quick look at that, until 1452, not really going to go after them at the moment, but my main key is Normandy, and now they have 12 troops and we have 10, so I'm not, I <laughs> That's my ultimate goal. Perhaps in this episode or the next episode, we'll try and declare war on these two provinces here. I mean, they are allied with people Barry's a target, but they're also loyal to us, but they're also allied to Wales and uh, Scotland again. We could go to war with Scotland again, I suppose. Uh, no, they're not allied to Scotland. They're allied to Cham this guy here, Champage. Um, but right now, we have a huge amount of debt, as you can see here, 24 loans to go through, and we are earning very little, and we're also coring this territory, so without further ado, we will start on this. You know, we have uh, military access, I'm going to ignore that. Uh, we have maxed out on our diplomatic relations, and uh, you know, we're... We're minus one of military power, but that's only because we have two leaders, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to boot one of them now. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Mm, perhaps not. Now we're going to keep him. Cancel that. We're going to keep him. Um, our main goal also in this episode... Hang on here. We could lose five prestige, family secret, uh, or our claim... The strength for the air is minus 20. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to say lose that. It, it barely even affects us. I don't even see any statistic which, you know, uh, claims that he's lost. Um, extra, you know, legitimacy to the throne. Um, as I was saying, technology really want to get something, really want to get some national ideas, marketplace and dock, and obviously get the Pike Square and extra, you know, uh, military tactics, and obviously the armory to increase manpower reserves. As you can see here, um, Barry's at war, in this little province here. Nope. That's interesting. Uh, I'm also looking, well maybe we could go to war with them, to, well, it's Toulouse, but Toulouse is currently in, being invaded by these guys, uh, you know what, we have a diplomat free, uh, we have a royal marriage with them though, ah, good thinking I saw that actually, well, you know, at the end of the day, uh, you guys here. Uh, you guys at what they are? They are at war with Switzerland. Where's Switzerland? There's Switzerland. Switzerland declaring war all the way up here. Interesting. Let's improve our relations with them. So ideally I want to start annexing countries pretty soon. And uh, if we look here, we can offer vassalization at some points, uh, bar's going to be vassalized, hopefully. It's going to make our borders look quite atrocious unless I can do something about it. 
I'm not too sure actually if we can vassalize them because our borders aren't joining. Hmm. Well, Lean's an annoying little country. Could go to war with these guys. They're allied with Barry, Holland, and Barr. They're the target of a coalition. Hmm. Novograd's having its own. Its own. Well, probably, I would say, civil war, actually. Um. Uh, so, what are we going to do here? Can we appoint a fine? So we're earning very. Ooh. Hmm. Might be out of war faster than like faster than I thought. We can invest in a new cotton. Yes. We've got him. We've outvoted Tuscany at the moment. Looking forward to getting my first advisor. I have to say, um It'd be nice when we can eventually afford it. As you can see, we have massive debt problems. I'm almost tempted. How are we doing with the coring? It's almost done. <coughs> Excuse me. Still cold. I am tempted to reduce our army maintenance even further down. You know, money is really important at this stage for me. And I really want to get some of my loans out before I declare war. And... That's who are you allied with? Ah, Normandy! That's a good point. That's a very good point. So we can't go to war with Normandy because they'll bring these guys into the war. And they'll have a troop advantage. Because <coughs> I don't think Barry's going to want to get into a war. Although they have war with Navarra here. Hmm. Why are they war with Navarra? I don't know. They're allied with us because we decided to forgive them. As you do. Truces will expire. Potential of revolts. I'm not going to do anything about the war exhaustion. It's going slowly. Uh, no. It'll disappear in time. Still getting some decent trade. Uh, see, eventually, uh, when we come to national ideas, I want to immediately get the diplomatic ideas because I want an extra diplomat. I want time. This it, this is exactly what I want. You know, it's it, it'll just help with negotiating with these large territories easier. A loan coming in soon. Oh dear. Can we pay back a loan? Yes, we can. We'll repay that back. So, <coughs> we're going to have to extend some of these loans, unfortunately. But oh well, uh, how are we doing with the Pope? How is the Pope doing? We're slowly getting there. We're slowly getting there. So is there any nations we can actually go to war with? Burgundy. I don't really want to get into a war with Burgundy. So the problem here is that they've all allied themselves with the surrounding neighbour, so it's going to make it incredibly hard. I can't go to war with these good dudes. East Frisia. It's Friesland. East Frisia's up there. They're guaranteeing the independence. You know what? I'm tempted to cross our borders here and go to war with them. Who are they? They're allied with York, don't need to really worry about them. Bremen, don't really need to worry about them. Brunswick, yeah again, these are just single province states. Okay, stop relation proving for them. Next goal is these territories here. Even if we can't conquer them, just vassalizing or gaining extra prestige. That would help. And, uh, no, we're not going to war on Maritim. 
it's covert. Oh yes, we need to be a neighbor. Or perhaps these guys, they have a Regency Cancel. Lancaster, Berry, Holland, Bar. Ah, oh, dear. Support some. <laughs> these guys would help. How much do we earn? 1.3. that. So now we're barely earning anything, but we are supporting rebels. I'd rather they switch to us. Anything else? <coughs> I really want to go to War of Orleans again. At last we have a truce time over them until, oh, it's three years away. Which in this game means a long, long time. I'm going to kick it up an extra, extra bit of speed. Oh, the war here ended. Normandy still got their territory. Interesting. Could get. Yeah, I don't really want to go to war with them. How about you guys? Burgundy. Normandy have declared war against these guys, Lancaster. Good. Very good. We're going to stop that. Alliance offered from Bar. We'll accept that because we have a royal marriage with them. So it won't exactly will not harm us. We can invest another cardinal. We'll keep investing into our one guy. Loan coming in. <coughs> oh, excuse me. We have a free of yeah free advisor slots. What can we do? Ages. Not wanted to become a defender of the faith. Generally, I think it's a waste of time. Ah, oh dear. Interesting. Interesting. What can we do? We'll lower army maintenance even more. We don't need them. We're at peace. It's peace time. If anything, I'm going to uh, up fleet maintenance a bit. At least a half. We're going to patrol Antwerp a bit more. Make sure that we get our fair share of the trade. We can also see what's going on here with York. Which is good. <laughs> Munster declared war. Okay. I'm very tempted to go to war with these guys. They are at war now. It's not really happening. Okay. Stop supporting rebels. We're gonna go to war with them. I kinda want the Flanders territory. Uh, okay, what should we do? We shall fabricate a claim from Calais. Our next goal. Conquer Calais, cut down this empire here. If Holland goes to war with us, we will still have the superior number advantage, I hope, without having to go to loans. It's good, we're gaining money again. Sorry if this is a quite dreary episode, but we're I'm sort of trying to get the idea of where I want to go to next, with Orleans sort of blocked for the next year, and even if I go there. Not entirely sure what I can do. Maybe vassalize it. Kind of wish we're not doing anything with the Pope now, because I want to try and improve relations with all these nations here. Like Brittany. Maybe. Maybe, just maybe, once I've done up with here, I focus on Britain itself? That would be a very strange turn of events. Because around this time, Britain was in the Hundred Years' War, obviously, with France. Be sort of a, you know, ironic twist that France would be in Britain. We invest in another cardinal. We are 
10 votes up. So we're nearing the Papal State influence <coughs> for, well, the Papal State guy that they like here. Which is good. That's the Holy Roman Empire. Can we join the Holy Roman Empire? I don't know if that's even possible. Let's have a look. There's the Holy Roman Empire. Do we have any borders? No, we... Ooh, we do! Get that. Stop. My relations with Austria is not good enough. Hmm. How are we doing with the Pope? Maybe that is what I should do. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Maybe that's what I should do. Join the Holy Roman Empire. France as the Holy Roman Empire. Could be interesting. Savoy got problems. How are they doing over here? Oh, the war seemed to have ended. Catalonia tried to get Valencia. Seems to have ended. Quite unsurprisingly, nothing really changed. Okay. <laughs> I think we'll go for that and immediately pay off some loans. We should be able to pay quite a fair few off at this stage. Yep, we're down to 20 now. Well, at least the, the Bank of France should know that we're very good with our loans. Okay, how are we doing over here? 56%. Yes, we are going to war. We're going to take your land. And hopefully the people state will like us. <coughs> they should do. Oh dear, they've discovered us. Our reputation will suffer. Well, that doesn't... That doesn't bother me. Again, for this war, I'm going to bring my fleet back. I don't really care if I'm blocked. Because at the end of the day... You know, this is gonna be a land. This is gonna be decided on land, and I'd rather keep my ships safe and not pay for them. Tonic order is at war. Is at war with Poland. You see, Poland seems to have seems to be getting back to its normal size. Interesting. There's a lot of things we could do here. Vest. Vest. Corsica. <coughs> Bloody cold. So it seems Normandy are in a losing war again. Who have they got in their allies? Just bury. It seems they're going to lose the war. Ow. Oh. Will people think I'm stupid? Will Barry join me? Hmm. He didn't like more. Who? <coughs> Pardon me. I like them a lot. I don't think we should, but... There we go. Conquest is done. Now. Shall we declare war? Who will join us? No one! Ah, and they're part of the Holy Roman Empire. Which, of course, makes sense, since I just looked at the Holy Roman Empire map. Hmm. Which means Austria will be able to get in here. How many troops does Austria have? Let me at the top. Austria. 7,000 men. That's enough to make the difference. A general has died. You have now inherited his positions. Uh, tell you what, we're going to fabricate a claim here as well. Take that one. I'm not too sure if I want to go to war now. Not any. I would if people joined me, but it seems that none of my allies wanted to join me, so I'll just happily go back to war with Normandy and take some of the stuff. We have an alliance. My nerves. We got a royal marriage with them. Have we got a royal marriage? Or 
Wars, please. View my country. Yes, we do. We will accept them. Ah, the Papal States. We have maxed out on the Papal States. Oh, so close. Perhaps if I provoke, proclaim a guarantee, perhaps we will get more. Proclaim guarantee. The Papal State will be protected by France. Are they like us? Yes! We're getting there. Too many diplomatic relations. Ah, yes, of course. Well, I'm only using them, I suppose. I'll revoke the guarantee once I've gotten this mission. Can we send them a gift? The answer is no, we cannot. But we can pay off a loan. I feel so impressed that we're paying off loans. So what can we do? <coughs> Excuse me. Can offer an alliance to the Papal State, we will do so. And there we go! And we have Game 5 Prestige. Excellent. And we can invest in the Cardinal, and we're going to do that. And we've got a new mission. Spread our culture there. Seems like a good goal. What would get? 10 diplomatic power. 25 diplomatic power and 5 prestige. Hmm. I don't see the payoff, to tell you the truth. And they hate our guts, so that's pointless as well. I suppose it's the only one we can do, really. Uh, spread our culture. By spending more culture to get culture. Hmm. <coughs> Will any of our allies join now? These are the questions. Declare war. Oh, they'll join us. But really, I want Brittany and all countries that are closer to me to join. War because Holland will get in. How much does Holland have? Holland, Holland, Holland. Eight fella, yeah, we ain't going to war. We ain't going to war with them. I suppose our revolt risk is up, but I'm going to have to end it here, folks. Uh, we're up to the next. Yeah, where where time is up. Uh, join us again for the next episode where hopefully we will invade Normandy and if not well we'll we'll pick a new target join us again thank you bye